Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Lesson for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Virgos. And this is the week of the third week. I want to say thank you to each and every person that um, reached out to me during the hurricane season time. Um, thank you for your support. Thank you for the wonderful uh, situation and the messages that you have given and the message that you have um, the prize that you have sent out for me thank you they <laughs> really works thanks um, it is the third week of um, September and the week begins from um, the 18 until the 24th okay this is a wonderful time for each and every person um, it is September it is a well watery month as usual and um, whatever is happening um, I'm seeing that you guys are leaving certain relationship and situation behind um whatever that is happening the devil is in your reading so we are going to see what is he going to do for you or do against you whatever is happening um there is a, a victory that is coming in um this can be a victory um but it, it has to do with a relationship okay so I can relationship in business or relationship in your private life or friendship let's see what is happening because this week is the week of the a full new journeys changes whatever is happening a lot of messages new journeys changes is going to happen in your life um, there is a connection of um, the earth energies and the air energies. So let's look and see because your week is here full of uh, um, a lot of one energy, uh, the nine of pentacles, the lovers, and the devil is here. So what is the devil bringing forth? Let's look at that. Okay. So let me put my glasses on so I can see what is your energy vibration number. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Queen of Coins. Mm. Mm. The number nine is going to be your energy vibration whatever has happened because I got the ace of swords but the ace of swords is as if they were saying it's not your victory so whatever is happening but they're saying the ace of swords is not your victory you have a situation to do with someone who you were working with there's a situation that was happening and that situation have to do with this queen it's as if you had a relationship with this person or you're working with this person this person can be someone on the work floor if you're working this person can be someone who's your teacher this some person but this is a weird person um and like as a queen but it could be a queen a king this is what i'm getting that this um cups person it could be a queen or king cups person and whoever you are you are in you both had done something and someone have had a victory over you both whatever has happened someone else has victorious um a, a big winning over you both okay it's as if this woman is actually pre pretending to be a man and it's a, it's a strange thing it's as if you both had something going it's, it's it's for friendship but it's like two people working against other people on the work floor it's it's not really and it's, it's a really um strange situation so whatever you and this woman was doing she's going to be your downfall in this week as we look forward on monday you have the energy of the nine of wands he seems to want to have you know there's messages that it's coming to you and you um, need to protect yourself from something whatever you're protecting yourself from you're protecting yourself from yourself um, some of you have not been um, on a positive end for the people who has been a positive side you're being protective whatever a message is coming in 
this message is going to be coming to say that you are protected you're spiritually protected for whosoever you are out there who has been working with negative energies and um, um, sending out negative energies to other people you need to realize who you are because whatever you send out you're going to get it back like 10 times whatever you sent out okay this is very sick there's a sick situation that has been going on because some people has been um, working with this queen who could be a scorpion I'm getting whether a scorpion man or woman to do something against someone else at their work or someone else in their um, you know company or um, group of people but you both are not going to get away with it okay you're digging your own grave at this moment as we move forward and to Tuesday we have the eight of ones the eight of ones is information coming at you and you are going to have regrets even before I saw the cards that was laid out you are going to have regrets there's a lot of information that is coming at you and you're going to have regrets you're going to be regretting what you have done you 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 both are going to be regretting what you have done you have no idea what you have done but you're going to be in serious serious problems okay this is what I'm getting and this is for people who have been working negative I'm going to give the energy of the positive people whatever the situation is with the lovers the queen of coins there was a situation that has to do and apparently um, okay I'm getting different scenarios so listen this energy of the lovers and this queen of coins whatever is happening this queen of coins in a relationship or you try to be in a relationship with this queen of coins and she has pushed you away for the, uh, whosoever was in a relationship with a Taurus of Virgo or a Capricorn okay and she pushed you away it is for a very good reason because she see who you was she was not working on your energy vibration for some people um, who are connected with this queen of ones is a a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn this person is very balanced this person know exactly what she wants okay so whatever has been happening there is a sort of a jealousy that the Queen of Cups was doing with you um, Virgo this is really you know insensitive to whatever has been going on and for some of you you could be having this relationship with this Queen of Cups it could be a flirt situation and that sort of a situation but you decide to come together to bring down someone else who is of a, um, a um, to bring down someone else who is a, maybe a Taurus or, or a Capricorn but you're not going to um, you have lost you have lost whatever you were trying to do it's very sad people it's very sad how insignificant you both are because why would you want to bring down someone who you don't even know isn't this the fault of jealousy and being very jealous and bad-minded okay we're going further positive energies now for the women out there if you're looking for a relationship it's going to be a very positive relationship for the women out there who are looking for a relationship looking to be connected to someone it's going to be a very positive relationship that is what I'm getting we're going forward to Thursday on Thursday the energy of the nine of Pentacles there is going to be a regret because somehow some of you women add uh, go in conjunction with another woman for money obviously you two women didn't have any money and decide to sell out someone else didn't work it didn't work you try to sell out someone else and it didn't work okay you were you try to sell out and just honestly do something against someone else and it never worked okay because the money that you were expecting to come in it's not going to come in on Sunday and Friday we had the energy vibration of the devil because whoever this person was this king of coins a king of coins is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn who you try to sell out your uh, um, someone who you work with a colleague or two whoever you try to sell this 
person out to obviously it didn't work you're not going to receive the money that this person promised you because this person um, you were found out and things fall through and you were found out and this person is going to sell you he's the devil in this guys he just um, use you both because you both just thought that someone promised you something you tried to sell out someone and it didn't work out he had you guys just bonded to um, feeling as if uh, he was going to give you the money and it didn't happen I was sad anyway we're going forward whatever it is you need to walk away from the situation because there's nothing else for you to learn okay um if you walk away from the situation you can make something better of your life it's it's just really sad because you know you Virgos are always you know people who are balanced but you know standing up and trying to sell out someone else who you are not aware of I guess you know this is one of the first time this is going to teach you a very good lesson and this is a lesson that you should always remember remember whenever people do good for you whenever you do people do good for you and you do bad to people this is what always happen you are now in the form of you need to get out of that resting period some of you are going to try to just fly away get away okay and this is going to affect people between the age, ages of 18 and 35 you're going to try to get away you're going to um, go in um, you know taking a rest off and try to get away because you realize that what you did didn't work out in your favor for the people who have been positive it's going to be a week where money is going to come to come into you whatever it is you're being protective for the people who were positive whatever it is you're being protective money is going to come out for you things are going to be happening to you um, whatever the situation is your material things is going to be um, provided for so whoever is out there and has been going through a rough time things are going to be start getting good for you and for the people who try to sell out someone else whether someone at your work whether a friend or something like that you know you got involved with this um, Scorpio person it's a Scorpio a cancer I'm feeling a Scorpio whatever it is I'm feeling a Scorpio person and you thought that there was something there this person was just using you and at the end of the day this person was using you because they promise you that this king of Pentacles the stars Virgo or Capricorn person it can be their Sun moon and rising sign was going to pay you some money to get some information on some situation and it didn't work out it just didn't work out and you know something good for you because whenever you decide to do something I work to work and do something against someone else to sell out someone else which you don't even know what is the first thing about it this is good because whatever you have done is going to turn back and bite you whatever karma you send out you will receive it and this is what is happening right now so ladies and gentlemen I'm sorry to bring forth this news but obviously something has been happening that the Universal Angels wants you to know that whatever karma you sent out is exactly what you're going to be receiving so let's move on um, it's not a week of love it's a week of really um, um, it's like the universe is teaching you Virgo something and it's not all of you it's absolutely not all of you uh, for some of you you're going to be connecting with the Queen of Cups which is going to be good in business or that sort of a thing but for some of you I'm getting just this thing that some of you tried to sell out someone some of you tried to pull the mat on the someone else and you fell down there was someone who promised you money and that money is not going to come true I'm sorry for this message but yeah I'm using Archangel Michael so let's see what Archangel Michael has to say explore your options so, dear God thank you for your wisdom and love helping me see understand and accept all of 
alternative options please guide me in the best direction for my health happiness and life purpose and this is so positive this is extremely positive this is really um, whatever the situation was uh, this is really going to teach you a lesson both of you it's going to teach you both a lesson oh intergalactican okay so for you Virgos or whoever it is the intergalactican council want to visit so they want you to visit so I visit the intergalactican councils today the intergalactican council is the 12 mass 12 great border uh, 12 great masters have made decision for the highest good of this universe the council includes master Marco um, Lord Illyrian Jesus um, Lord Astra uh, Lord Kuntumia uh, Elmora Paul from the Virgin Saint Germain Queen Yen Lady Nada Serasmus Bay and the Lord Maitre saying and thinking the names raise your energy vibration recognize you are a multi-dimension beams connecting with your deepest wisdom and focus on the well-being of the universe your guidance is to ask the universal angels by Lee to take you to the intergalactic councils in a meditation or a sleep time offering to service the universe this will greatly expand your consciousness so your message is I visit the intergalactic council today I visit the intergalactic council today so ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you please remember under love is real and um, uh, um, share these uh, videos um, please like and share these videos and I want to say namaste until next week